Hey guys, it's Ilya Miguel from Toy Chris 101, and I just want to say thank you to our friends over at Beast Kingdom for sending us this amazing Superman statue for Autism Wear this month. That's right, on this episode of That Geek Statue Show, right here on Toy Quest 101, we're going to be unboxing the Batman vs. Superman Dawn of Justice Mastercraft Superman statue from our friends over at Beast Kingdom. And that was what's going to start right now. now. Hey guys, welcome back to this episode of That Geek Statue Show right here on Toy Quest 101. Now, like Ileana said, we're super excited because we partnered up with our friends over at Beast Kingdom to bring you this Batman versus Superman Dawn of Justice Mastercraft statue. And we're so pumped up because this is from the movie and this is from the iconic scene where somebody vandalizes the Superman monument over at Heroes Park. And this is the Superman monument. So it's a little different than what we normally open up, but I'm so excited to do so. Now, before we start, we want to remind you guys to subscribe to Toy Quest 101 and don't forget to hit that notifications bell so you don't miss any toy reviews, statue unboxings, or any celebrity guests that might pop up on our show. Now, Yana, what can you tell us about the box? Well, it's a simple box. It's a cardboard box and it has cool pictures around the box and I can't wait to open it. All right. Speaking of unboxing it, why don't we just get to it? Hey guys, welcome back. We just got done unboxing this cool Superman statue and he looks absolutely amazing. That's right. We want to thank our friends over at Beast Kingdom for supporting us during Autism Awareness Month and sending us this amazing Superman Mastercraft statue. I think it looks pretty cool, right? Yeah. All right. So this is a really neat statue because this is the Batman versus Superman Dawn of Justice Mastercraft Superman statue. Now this is the Superman Monument statue from Heroes Park that got vandalized by Wallace Vernon Keefe who got paralyzed during a fight between Zod and Superman during the Metropolis attacks. And this looks really cool because if you guys remember in the movie, he did spray paint false God on the chest. And we're going to talk a little bit about that later. But what's the first thing out of the box? The first thing out of the box is a COA and it's an elegant envelope and it's 639 out of 3000. That's right. This is limited to 3000 pieces, guys. But we also partnered up with Beast Kingdom to offer you guys a cool discount. All the links are going to be in the bio of the video for you guys to own this for your very own collection and get a discount courtesy to us here at Toy Quest 101 and our partners over at Beast Kingdom. Now, Eliana, what can you tell me about this statue? Um, I think it looks really cool. I love the base and it looks like a real statue from the movie. I think it looks absolutely amazing. That's right. Now, one of the coolest things about this statue is this right here. And this is what I love about this statue. I love when things are different. And this is super cool because this is just so iconic from the movie. Like I said before, this, this monument got vandalized and it does come with a UV light. Here it is. And if you go ahead and you shine the UV light on his chest, 
it does say false god now this is really cool you don't see this in your everyday statues so i thought that was a really cool surprise from this i wasn't expecting it and i really thought that was cool now i'm not your biggest movie statue guy but this is really neat and if you guys are movie buffs and you love to have a collection of the movie statues especially superman man this is one right here to have because it is different and like i said it's a monument paying tribute to superman and again in the movie there was a lot of controversy and superman wasn't really looked at as a hero uh, from a lot of people and this monument did get vandalized which was a big part in the movie and i think it looks really cool right yeah all right so let's talk about the statue itself obviously it's just one color because it is symbolizing a monument a real statue at a park um so i think the paint applications look really good and the sculpt looks exactly like he poses in the movie so i thought that was really neat now let's talk about the base the base is really cool because it does have a plaque here in the front that does say what it is it says it's a superman monument and it has a coa on it as well the numbered serial number to this statue and i thought that was pretty cool so this is just you know paying homage to that go whole, that whole entire scene in the movie uh batman versus superman dawn of justice and like i said guys if you are a movie buff and you love your movie statues and you're a dc fan this is definitely one to have in your collection i thought that was pretty cool Eliana, what can you tell me about it I mean, it looks absolutely amazing. I love it. All right, so super cool. Uh, not a lot to say, right, about this statue because it speaks for itself. But like I said, it's something different to have in your collection. And if you're a movie buff, this is really the way to go. And I love this. This right here is what made this statue. The fact that it does have false god on his chest. And this is really cool to actually have a light here shining, uh, you know, on his chest. Maybe you could get something different uh, to go ahead and showcase that false god graffiti on there. But I really thought I, the technology behind this was really cool, right? What a great idea. Yeah. Uh, uh, paying attention to details when it comes to this statue uh, and bringing stuff right out of the movie into our home. So super cool. But Ileana, what can you, wait, where can you tell us where they can find us? You can find us on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and TikTok. And don't forget to subscribe to Toy Quest 101. We want to thank you guys over at Beast Kingdom for supporting Autism Awareness and sending us this amazing statue. And for you viewers at home, like we said, we're going to have the link in the bio of the video with a cool discount for you guys. And we'll see you on another episode of Toy Quest 101. Bye, guys. Bye.